up everyone? I'm your female Taku and I'm here to review episode 19 of Assassination Classroom Season 2. And this episode, I'll be honest, it didn't feel like Assassination Classroom at some points. Or at least for me, it didn't feel as believable. I don't know, maybe it's just me. Maybe it's just me. Don't get me wrong. The episode was a really nice episode. I'd say it was more on the relaxing side when it came to Karma and Nagisa's friendship when they were all right in space and stuff. I found that really chill and uh, it didn't just seem like assassination class. And the atmosphere seemed rather different this time. And with this episode, Karma and Nagisa infiltrate like NASA area thing. I don't really know what you call it at the moment. <laughs> uh, my mind's at a blank. But they infiltrate this NASA-like area to get into a spacecraft and get over into space so that they can get some data from the American astronauts so they can try to find a cure for Kuro-sensei. And the reason why I'm saying that it doesn't really feel too much, too much like assassination in the classroom with this episode is I thought that when they were infiltrating the area, I thought it was too easy. It felt way too easy. Normally there's a bit more of a challenge. Actually, almost always there's some sort of challenge, but this one was really simple. I don't know, maybe it was to show us how much E-Class has grown, but it just seemed way too easy, and I think it's because of Ritsu. Ritsu made everything all the more simple, and we actually didn't really need too many of the classmates of E-Class to help out with the mission, so I don't know, it just... It didn't seem like a Assassination Classroom this time. Maybe it's just me, I don't know. But this time we had the return of the English. Oh, the English. I didn't think we'd see that again. No, I did not. I'm not gonna lie, Karma's English was certainly a lot better than the first time we heard it. Oh my goodness. You guys remember if you saw that one review when we first heard Karma speak English. Ooh. Oh, I went off on that because that one, just, that was pretty bad. Really, really bad. Nagisa spoke English. <laughs> Nagisa's English. Oh dear. Nagisa's is bad. Karma definitely got better. And I thought the astronauts were, were pretty f decent in my opinion. I was able to understand them the majority of the time. I just thought it was really hilarious though. At the end, they were all like, oh no. <laughs> like what? <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, anyway, it was, it was overall a rather tame episode. And so they got the data on how to cure Koro-sensei and they just need to develop a drug that one of the students can easily whip up. So, hmm. What other challenges are E-Class going to face? We still have about six, five episodes left. What other challenges is E-Class going to face? I don't know, maybe it will take a while to make this drug. Maybe the drug won't even work the first time. I don't know. But I guess we'll just have to wait and see. Huh. You, you, you see? I, it just didn't feel the same. Uh, I, I'm repeating myself. Did, did you guys feel like the episode was different anyway? Manga readers, was this adapted properly? Was it rushed? Were, th were things left out? Just just let me know. I know this review is rather short, but there, it, there really wasn't too much to say. And yeah, that's, I guess that's all for the review today. Huh. Even this review doesn't feel like my normal assassination classroom reviews. <laughs> oh well, I suppose. Catch me later as I review Kabaneri. I'm your female Taku, sayonara.